Hi, my name is Reginald Conley of PLX Technology. I'm the Director of Applications. And today we're going to discuss a little bit about PCI Express Gen 3 over optical connectivity. As you can see from this diagram here, what we're going to demonstrate is an example of a host PC going through one of our new generation of PCI Express switches, Gen 3 version, 8 gigabits per second, across an optical engine, optical fiber, through a second engine, back through our switch, and then through other devices such as an SSD controller and an Ethernet NIC, we'll demonstrate how you can use Express to actually show these other signals without any changes in software or configuration. So here's an example of our PCI Express Gen 3 first switch ever built. It's a demo version and it's called our Scout Card. Here's an example of a PCI Express based SSD controller. Here's an example of a PCI Express Ethernet NIC card, also used in the demonstration. As we can see here, here's a demonstration of the host, host device. Here we have our scout card located in the host. Here are the optical engines which will convert the electrical energy to optical energy. This device will take the optical, the second engine, and convert it back to electrical. And then we move into our second card, Gen 3 card, which will hold a Ethernet NIC and also the SSD drive, which by the way, that drive from Fusion I.O. is a part in which we also have a PCI Express switch. For the first part of the demonstration, we'll show you an example of using a half meter LC patch cord. Next, we'll then take a 30 meter patch cord and show you the difference in performance. As you can see here, here's an example of our yet to be released Gen 3 SDK, our software development kit. This kit should be coming out in approximately December of 2010. In this, in this picture, what you see is an example of our ability to measure both eye width and eye height. In this example, we have the half meter optical cable in which it, after the optical signal passes back through, through our device into our switch, we measure the eye quality and this is the resultant output. As you can see, we've now removed the half meter optical cable and replaced it with 30 meters of optical cable. Next, we will use our PLX software to again run the optical eye and determine what the resultant eye looks like. As you can see, there's no measurable degradation in the eye quality. Here we have the internet being run by an Ethernet NIC card showing actual video from one of our websites. Now I will bring up the PLX enabled Fusion IO SSD card. As we'll see here in a moment, we'll now be able to run video on the SSD card while still obtaining data from the internet. So note, in this demonstration, there were no software modifications to make this, this demo run. With Express, you have the ability to handle multiple legacy devices without any changes. As you move forward and we move forward with dem other demonstrations, you'll find that we can bond multiple lanes of Express and create very wide optical connectivity. As prices continue to drop, we'll find that Express will continue to grow and optical usage will continue to grow also. For more information about PCI Express technology, visit our website at plxtech.com.